Yo, what is going on guys? It's Juan Solo here with A Squad Gaming and welcome back to the channel. Thank you all so much for tuning in today for some more State of Decay 2. Yes, I know it has been a long time since we've talked about State of Decay 2 here on the channel, but we have a few things to talk about today. So I know that I haven't been making a lot of content lately, guys. I've been so busy with a lot of things in my life right now. It's just been super, super busy. But I wanted to talk to you guys about some possible new DLC and or updates coming to State of Decay 2 very soon. So we've had, you know, like your 2.0, your 3.0, your 4.0 updates and stuff like that that really aren't sort of hyped, I guess you could say. You know, State of Decay 2 Undead Labs, you know, tweets it out after the update goes live. You know, they release the patch notes, that kind of thing. But just the other day, Xbox actually put out a tweet here that I'm going to pop up on screen. And it says, tune in to the XO18 at 3 p.m. Central Time. I think that's Central Time. Maybe that's not central time. I don't know. But on November 10th for big PUBG news, the Forge expansion for Shadow of the Tomb Raider, and then it says hashtag State of Decay 2 updates and more exclusive looks. So, with all of the updates and stuff that have came out for State of Decay 2 over the last, you know, six months or so since, you know, the game came out back in, I think, May, you know, it's, this is something different. It's not just a normal update. I don't know if I would go to the full extent of calling it possibly a new DLC or a first look at a new DLC. It might be. But just the fact that they're tweeting this out at an actual like gaming event, that leads me to believe that this is going to be more than just your standard straightforward hotfix or you know like your 4.0 patch or 4.1, stuff that normally they would just release on the website and then tweet out the patch notes and stuff. I almost want to say because of their announcing it like this, it's more. I'm not sure exactly what it could be. Personally, the one thing that I would love to see just come to State of Decay 2 would be like a breakdown DLC that was in State of Decay 1. As we move maps, the game gets harder and harder and harder, and we can keep track of that. Cleo drops, stuff like that. Like, very similar to how Breakdown was in State of Decay 1. Make it the same way in State of Decay 2. Give us a new map that we can cycle through all four maps so we have a new playable area and stuff like that. And so many State of Decay 2 players would be more than happy, at least for the time being, obviously, if we had a new map. Maybe a few new weapons and stuff like that, some different bases and stuff, especially if there's a new map, and just break down in State of Decay 2. You know, it just, it makes sense. That was such a good game mode in State of Decay 1, I don't understand, like they kept saying in like the, the early builds of the game, all the way up to launch, that State of Decay 2 was sort of like Breakdown DLC 2.0. I don't see it that way. I don't see the difficulty really increasing. The game overall really isn't that hard of a game. And I would really like them see them, you know, stress difficulty moving forward. Make the game harder. Make us allow the game to be harder depending on how we want to progress through the game. But overall, I'm really excited to see what State of Decay 2 has to offer with this news moving forward. But that is going to be this weekend, November 10th. They are going to be releasing this news, whatever it may be. Maybe it's a teaser to a new DLC. Maybe it's a teaser to some really cool updates and stuff coming to the game to kind of maybe breathe new life into the game. Only time will tell. Also, guys, just let me know down your thoughts down below in the comment section. You know, like I said, I haven't been posting a lot of content. I've just been super busy. State of Decay 2 is really dry right now. There's not a whole lot to do in the game. But what would you guys like to see in some of these move updates and stuff moving forward with State of Decay 2? What do you want to see? What do you expect to see? Do you guys think it's just an update? Or do you think this could possibly be a teaser or something of a future DLC that could come out down the road? Let me know your thoughts and opinions down below in the comments. And as always, guys, if you guys enjoy the video, make sure to drop a like. And obviously, I know you guys want to see some more State of Decay 2 content and stuff on the channel. Maybe we can go back and start doing a, a new playthrough or something like that maybe once a week or something just to kind of get back into the game um, but uh, overall like I said there's not a lot to cover in the game but if you guys just want to see some straight up let's plays and stuff of State of Decay 2 and Ghost Recon maybe some ghost mode and stuff like that let me know down your comments and stuff down below but overall guys like I said that's going to do it for the video if you guys enjoyed it make sure to drop a like and subscribe if you are new but overall that is all for the video thank you all so much for watching and I will catch you guys later peace out